Hello YouTube, um, today I'll be just showing you how to delete files from Windows Media Player without like because um, you can't do it because it's not allowing you but I'm going to show you what I mean uh, if I open Windows Media Player So if I try to delete this, right click, delete, it's not working. So this uh, this is what I'll be showing you how to do. So the main thing you need to do first is to disable Windows Media Sharing if you have that enabled. So you want to click the starting orb, type services. Uh, it will be the first one at the top click yes um, make this bigger so you can see it um, stretch this out uh, you want to go down until you see windows and then you can finally see it says windows media player network sharing service it says started you want to stop that Do not close it, you're going to keep it open so when you're done you can re-enable it. So just minimize it at the moment. The next thing you need to do is either click Control Alt Delete, Start Task Manager, and then click File and then New Task Run, or the fastest way is just to type Run. And then I'll put this in the description. You are going to need this you don't need the full stop you're going to need this and then copy it into the open and then click OK and the files you will be looking for are the current database and local MLS folder I mean files so if I go down they're not hard to find they're mostly together so you can see the current database so you want to click control and just click all of them so MLS O that two three four and that's it and then just click delete click yes and then you need to re-enable the sharing service as I said at the start so you want to click start and you can finally close it close that go back to Windows Media Player and you can finally see there is no items in your music library thank you for watching please rate comment and subscribe